Hi, this is Justice. In this tutorial, we are going to talk about the layout editor. The layout editor can be accessed in the pen tool by clicking here with a preset selected. It will open up that specific preset like this. If the preset is short, then you can press this big preview button. It basically means dock. So that's going to push your program off to the side the same way that this layout over here for the Tablet Pro Manager is doing. Now to turn these on, Win Shift Z, turn on and off the correct one if you open up the layout manager. All right, in this one, we're going to talk about just how to open the layout editor and how to purchase. Right here is where you purchase. Right here is where you edit. If you see an artist pad on the screen, you can right click on it, choose layout, edit layout. You can get there that way. In settings, you can click on Edit Layout with Store app. This exists in all three of these different modes. Now for saving the presets, what I recommend doing is uh, using the same folder that the presets in the pen tool are stored so that everything stays together. If you're uninstalling Tablet Pro, make sure you make a backup of your presets and, and save it somewhere not inside the app. Okay, so to find the preset location, click open right here. It should be Tablet Pro Pen Tool, My Presets. What I do is I go back here and then I right click and choose Pin to Quick Access. You can see my folder right here. This makes it really easy for me to keep everything organized. This is what I recommend you do as well. Uh, let's open up the Rebel preset. So we're gonna click on this button. We're gonna click on Big Preview to get it to span the entire height. And then when we save, if you're saving to share with someone or you're saving, I recommend changing the name. So we're gonna go over here. I have my presets pinned to quick access and I'm going to have this one and I'm going to name it Preset Rebel 5 Justice because that's my name. <laughs> so now we have this one loaded. Now, if we make any changes, so let's say we delete this and we save what will happen is it'll update the next time we launch it. So let's go over here. Let's go ahead and load this one. Now let's make a change. Right here, this is enter. So we're gonna add the checkbox again. And now when we save it, this is not the same one. All right, so we need to load this one. Okay. All right, so now we have this one here. If we make a change, so let's go ahead and delete that and save. It will update. If it doesn't update, then you can just right click here and choose Artist Pad. Just turning Tablet Pro on and off will reset this. It'll refresh. All right, let's go back there and undo that. And there we go. All right, you guys, that's it for this first video. This is how to open the layout editor, how to purchase, and how to save the presets once you've got them loaded. In the next video, we're going to be going over the UI inside the Tablet Pro Manager, the layout editor, same thing, as well as how to load the Tablet Pro Manager preset in order to give you some easier access to the buttons and the functions here. All right, I'll see you in the next video.